Just a disclaimer real quick before we start this video because I know there are going to be those people out there, those motherfucking haters, man. Fuck them. But just a disclaimer real quick. Please understand first things first. Uh, all these clothes that you guys see, like, obviously I'm just doing this because this video was requested and I thought it would be a cool video. In no way am I trying to show anybody up or one-up anybody. This is just my collection of clothes. I can't help uh, the quantity that's in there. That's just what I have accumulated over the past years. Please understand, like... It wasn't just like last week or last month that I just like started getting all this shit. Like this has been years and years of collecting clothes and still really it's not that much uh, compared to some other people that I've seen. But this is just an accumulation over time and more importantly than anything, uh, all of this stuff was paid for by me and myself only. I have went to work and uh, made money and I've chose to spend my money the way that I've spent it so and none of this shit was gifted to me none of this stuff was bought by anybody else other than myself so understand that before you guys are judging or thinking that I'm trying to show off or one up anybody this is just my collection of clothes that's been accumulated over time and again more importantly I made all that money to buy all those clothes so really if there was 10 times the amount it shouldn't matter uh, if I'm the one that's making the money to buy the shit. So I hope you guys enjoy the video. Don't take it like up the ass or too serious. This is just me showing what's inside my closet. So let's get to it. All right, YouTube, what is good up in your hood? It is the one and only, the man himself, Sleepy. Today, uh, I am going to do a different kind of video. People have been uh, requesting like a closet tour or like a room tour. So I will give that to you guys today uh, under certain circumstances. Right now my closet is like not the way I would entirely want it to be. I'm eventually going to end up redoing my whole closet. Uh, but I'm just doing a bunch of other shit right now. So I'm going to show you guys the studio that I'm building right now. If you guys don't know, if you guys watch my previous videos, then you guys probably know that I'm building a studio. So I'm going to show you guys that because that is like my room in the house. And then I will show you guys the room where I sleep. And then I will show you guys my closet as well. Just understand that I live with a female. But my room is not like my room was like when I lived at my mom's house where I could like have my shit up on the walls and have my shit everywhere. Obviously, I live with a female. Uh, so the room decorations and shit like that is more in her favor. Just my clothes are in that closet. And then the studio that I'm in right now, this is like my room, what I'm doing in here and uh, where my creativity uh, and my mind can uh, be at work in this room so I'll just show you guys basically like how I organize my clothes what my closet looks like how I keep my clothes uh, because I do like to keep it organized uh, and some of you guys have been asking for it and then um, as the subscribers grow and the views grow and the channel gets bigger and my closet gets finished I will do like a definite closet tour and then of course when the studio is finished I will do a studio tour too but I'll just give you guys some basic information just a quick view of the studio and then a quick view of my closet uh, just so I can get this video to the people that have been requesting it thank you for the support follow me on Instagram subscribe to the channel if you are not already let's do it so first things first this is the studio this is like my little room right here as you guys can see, it is not done. This is one wall right here. Uh, this is like these carnival stripes me and Alexandra did on this wall. These are all hand painted. Like I took painter's tape and a level and leveled out and drew out all of these lines. And I painted them one by one. And then on this wall, we have the polka dots. Uh, I got this pattern from Tyler's uh, couple pieces that Tyler has done. All these polka dots are hand drawn and hand painted. Uh, by myself and Duvina and then the whole little desk area is finished I mounted these speakers up here they're like all cordless all the cords are going through the wall and then we built this whole desk this is a closet I took off the doors and uh, yeah so this is the desk we hand built this desk and it's like all supported underneath there's a bunch of chairs so I'm not gonna go down there uh, but we hand painted this whole watermelon desk 
and put this shit in here by hand and then we blasted the FTP mural right there. I don't know if there you go, you guys can see it right there. Uh, obviously that is where the computer sits, that is where like all the keyboards are and all the fucking midis and all the beat pads and all that shit. And then in the corner of course we got the mic. As you guys can see, this wall is not painted right here. This wall is not painted and the ceiling is not painted. Uh, so it is a work in progress. Uh, you know, I'm trying to chip out away it slowly, but surely, but dude, look here. We got a fridge right here. That's gonna go in the studio. We got fucking posters over here. Just a bunch of shit. Check this fucking, I got this big ass wolf poster right here. Uh, that's gonna go somewhere in here. And then all this shit is like all my decorations right here. I got all these decks right here. These fucking baker decks. These fucking cream decks. These fucking, just a bunch of shit in here. I got Pillows and fucking blankets, towels, Buddha heads, fucking, I got floor mat, rugs, books, fucking, I don't know what's in here. I got a bunch of shit in here, just water bottles, soccer balls, just a fucking gang of shit all over here. So eventually, this couch is going to be smaller. I'm going to get a smaller couch, and then the whole mic setup will be right there, then all the cords. Uh, we'll run to the interface and then we will do like all the production shit over there and then on this wall Bam, there's gonna be a big ass TV with a TV stand the Xbox all that shit uh, So it's a work in progress But this is just where I keep all my shit for now because like I said I let Alexandra do her thing in my bedroom and then I just uh, Have my way with it in here, but Alexandra has helped me a lot with this room and uh, yeah So this is the studio it's in progress right now, but when it's done, you guys are going to trip your balls off, dude. This studio is going to be insane, dude. So let me take you guys to my bedroom. Alright, my bad. I had to close the door because Carson's trying to sleep. But alright, this is my bedroom. Obviously, we fucking walk through the door right here. Excuse the light. I'm doing this at night right now, but this is my bedroom. Like I said, the decorations and shit are more uh, in Alexandra's favor. This is my bed right here. Uh, this is my fucking pile of work clothes right here. And then we will get into the closet right here. Let me close this door so I can just fucking open it for you guys. What's up? Alright, so here is the closet. We will open up the first side right here. Again, please understand I'm just showing you guys like how I set up my clothes and what it looks like. I'm not going to go into detail or depth about any of these pieces or what I have in my closet. I'm just strictly showing you guys how I set it up and how I keep my shit organized. So I got this big ass thing right here from like Walmart or Target, I think. Uh, it's just like a little organizer as you guys can see I put all my clothes in there if you start from the bottom That's like my pants and like my sweatpants and all my like swim trunks and sweat shorts And then all this right here is just all my shirts that are still in the packaging that I don't like Want to get dust on or everything just a full row of that and then the rest of it is basically just basic t-shirts you guys probably saw this stack on Instagram. And then these are all just like my skate shirts and shit. Like all my Thrasher and Spitfire and Death Wish, World Industry, Shake Jump, Baker. Uh, I'm a huge like core skateboarding fan. I love core skateboarding brands. And then you got some shoes up there. And then all my pants are right here. If you guys want to see a video on what kind of pants I wear, uh, I will do that video. Because pants are very uh, a iffy subject for me. But, you know... I end up doing well with a certain kind of brand, but here's all my shoelaces hanging around this candle And then as you guys can see up here This is like my little hat rack or little hat row right here I got like one two three four five rows and then I don't know if you guys can see they're like six or seven hats deep on every row There's just hats and hats and hats and hats and hats and hats and hats and, hats and, hats and just Hats, more hats, more hats, more hats, more hats, more hats. Just a bunch of hats, but that's how I uh, stack them up right there. I just keep them right there in like five or six rows, and then I stack them deep. And then, of course, you got the astronaut chilling, of course, but that's one side of it. And then if you open the other side of it, this is all my hanging shit right here. Let me move this stuff. 
Uh, so the clothes and t-shirts are on one side and then that thing stops right there and then that's where like all my hanging stuff starts uh, and it is getting full for sure this thing is like starting to bow down in the middle I got all my shit hanging right there all right so this part right here is like where I keep all my boxers and socks and beanies and like shit that I don't really wear every single day there's just like a bunch of socks up here and socks up here and fucking socks up here and boxers up here and then there's a shitload of boxers here and there's a bunch of socks that are still in the packaging uh that i don't want to take out of the packaging until i wear them some ralph lauren boxers all my beanies some more socks another beanie and then all my hanging stuff and then at the bottom is where my shoes are honestly this is the thing that gives me the most anxiety i'm trying to like straighten up my shoe section and like organize my shoes better but here is some of my shoes uh, again not all of them I have boxes of shoes elsewhere but uh, here's just a little view of like how I set up my shoes I guess nothing really that crazy there's no room looks fucking pairs are just chilling on the floor but um, like I said this is all my hanging stuff right here even like my normal like sweatshirts and shit are in here and eventually uh, when I fix my closet I am not trying to have like all these sweatshirts and like all this normal uh, sweatshirts and crew necks hanging up. I only want to hang up stuff like this, like this FTP trench coat and like this FTP fucking work jacket right here. Uh, I just want that kind of like bigger, heavier stuff hanging. And then like I want to hang like all these sweaters, sweatshirts, crew necks. Uh, all these hoodies I want all these to be folded uh, like the shirts are so eventually it will be like that that is what my hanging section looks like right now again that is not all of my shit uh, that is just what fits in this closet then you got like some organizing shit up here again and then on the bottom is the shoes and then we will go to the other side again and then these are just all of my t-shirts again that's how I organize my t-shirts just in this little like thing, this thing helps uh, very, very much. You can stack your t-shirts up like that and make them look sexy as hell. Uh, so like I said, shorts and stuff at the bottom and then all the way up to t-shirts, some more shoes, and then my hat's right there. And then there's another little compartment thing over here that I keep clothes in. These are like more of my everyday clothes, just boxers, socks, shirts, like shirts, undershirts, more pants I wear every day. And then there's just still, dude, just drawers of shit in here, like golf shit and huff shit, supreme shit, just like packages that fucking aren't even open, thrasher shit, more supreme shit, supreme shit. Huff shit, supreme shit. A lot of this stuff in this drawer belongs to Alexandra. She has like a little collection going on. Uh, but here's fucking more supreme shit still in the package. So everything is kind of scattered. Uh, not really in like an indefinite place except uh, in my closet, which I said before I'm trying to move and uh, expand my closet. Eventually, I'm going to take out the like this little rack up here i'm gonna take this out and then i am just going to start from the bottom up i'm gonna like build a platform and then i'm just gonna build up from that and i'm gonna make like as many compartments as i want uh and just make it exactly how i want it so all my shit can fit in there all my shoes can fit in there all my clothes uh in one solid place so uh, that was for the people that asked for like the little closet tour video. I'm sorry if I'm talking uh, low. It's late at night. Carson's asleep right now. But uh, that is like I guess the partial closet review. Again, I will be doing another one when I finish the closet and I finish the studio. But that is like kind of like my workspace you guys just saw. And then like how I organize my clothes. Uh, so let me know what you guys think about the video. If you guys have any questions like what's the best way i don't know like i fold shirts or how do i do this or how do i do that let me know in the comments or hit me up via direct message and i will get back to you guys let me know what you guys think about my organization skills and uh, just let me know what you think about the video 
And if you guys want to see more shit like this, like into like my personal, maybe like in my house or just in my personal life in general, make sure to let me know in the comments and we will be sure to get that video out to you guys. Thank you for the support. Follow me on Instagram. We are almost at a thousand subscribers. Uh, so once we get there, I promise that we will do a dope ass giveaway and peace out to all you motherfuckers and peace out from the closet too. Big.